Assalamu alaikum friends. I hope you all are well and enjoying learning with language and linguistics. Today we are going to talk about word formation. This is the lesson of morphology. This one is the fourth lecture presented by language and linguistics. So let's move to our first slide. Word formation is an important process in morphology and I have discussed from 1 to 5th word formation process in my previous lecture. Now we are going to discuss from 6th to 9th the process of word formation. But before moving to this, I would like to recall the definition of word formation that is the creation of new words in language or semantic chain is also called word formation. Clipping is a word formation process. In clipping, word of more than one syllable is reduced to a shorter form, usually beginning in clear speech. For example, X, S, Ed, Bra, Cab, Fan, Flu. These are the clipping form of the word. Similarly, English speakers also like to clip each other names as Al, Ed, Liz, Mike, Sam, Sue, and Tom. Clipping is also important in educational environment where we can see exam, gym, lab, math, poly, science, and proof. These are all examples of word formation in English language. Hypochorism is another type of the reduction, the form of the word. In hypochorism, longer word is reduced to a single syllable and Y or I E is added to the end of the word. This type of reduction is usually favored in Australian and British English and this process is known as hypochorism. Examples are movie from the moving picture, telly from television, barbie from barbecue, bicky from biscuit, bookie from bookmark, Bracky from the breakfast, hanky from the handkerchief and to take a sicky a day of sick leave from the work these are the example of hypochorism in english language Back formation is another type of reduction of the form of the word. This is a special kind of reduction. In back formation, word of one type, usually a noun, is reduced to form a word of another type. This is verb. So, noun is used as verb in back formation. For example, television, we have televise, donate, donation, emote, emotion, and labification. Slabify, orientation, orient, or orientate. Similarly, work, worker, edit, editor, babysit, babysitters, burgle, burglars, swindle, and swindlers. These are the examples of word formation in English language. Our last process of word formation from this lecture is conversion. Conversion is a change in the function of a word. For example, when a noun comes to be used as a word without any reduction in its form. Other labels for this common process are category change and functional shift. Nouns such as bottle, butter, chair, and vacation are come to be used as verb in conversion. Similarly, phrasal verbs like to print out or to take over also become nouns and we use a printout and a takeover. Similarly, we bottled the home brew last night. Have you buttered the toast? Someone has to chair the meeting. They are vacationing in Florida. Noun to verb and verb to noun examples are dust. Did you dust the living room? Glue. I will have to glue it. Referee. Who will referee the game? Water. Would you 
वॉट आर माई प्लांट्स एंड वर्ब टू नोन एग्जाम्पल्स आर टू चीट ही इज अ चीट आउट वी हैड सम डाउट्स हैंड आउट आई नीड अ हैंड आउट टू हायर हैव टू न्यू हायर दीज आर द एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ कन्वर्जन इन इंग्लिश लैंग्वेज for running the lecture i would like to summarize the important points of this lecture word formation is the creation of new words or you can say semantic change is also called word formation in word formation we have a process that is called clipping in clipping word of more than one syllable is reduced to a shorter form similarly we have hypercorism here word is also reduced in single syllable but the main difference is why are ie added at the end of the word and we have movie from the moving picture next is back formation this is another type of reduction in the form of the word here we use noun as verb for example donate donation emotion from emo mix from mixture another type of word formation is conversion in conversion we use verb as noun and noun as a verb so function of a word is change in conversion thank you for watching please like share and subscribe this channel for getting more videos about these topics you can also find pdf file of this lecture in the description section thank you